Hello everyone, this is Boricua Binks and welcome back to Let's Play Murder by Numbers where we are in chapter 3 and we are just speaking to the fabulous Fran who is a drag queen and we're trying to find out more about this uh, incident that happened at her club. So let's continue on. Okay, we already spoke to her. I mean, we have more that we could talk to her about, but let's gather some evidence. Oh my gosh. This is huge! Ten. Two. And one. Hmm. Eight and four is twelve. Let's see. Oops. One, one, one. Okay. Uh-oh. Is a problem already? Maybe. Uh, six is probably within there somewhere. Uh, one, two, three. Yeah, we got a problem already. Uh, this one is definitely set in stone.
these are done. These are all done. Done. Two is here. Two is there. Okay, what do I need? Done, 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 done. Uh, done. Okay. Two. And two. Alright, not bad. Oh, okay. Rainbow flag, nice. There are a lot of these flags around, even for a gay bar. I like them. They're so colorful. Do you think I could take one? It would look nice in your apartment. Oh, so you're an interior decorator now. Well, you'll have to ask Fran. Maybe she'll let you take one of the small ones. <laughs> That's cute. Oh, is that it? Okay. I thought we would find more. Okay, let's present some evidence then. Hmm? Sorry, but if it isn't urgent, I got a lot of stuff to be dealing with here. Okay. We found a passport on the body. His name was Oliver Laurel. Oh, the poor thing. Yes, I know him. He'd been coming here regularly for the past few months. At first, he was fairly quiet, blended into the background, but Oliver seemed troubled. I got the impression he was working a lot of things out. Some people start this journey with more baggage than others, if you catch my drift. Anyways, I... Oh, what was that? Sudden interruption. Come on, Ho Honor, hurry up. I need to talk to Fran. You're damn right you do, mister. Only way I can get you to visit many more is by getting a hole smashed in the front of my club. Stop that guilt tripping right now and give me a hug. Ouch! Oh? What's wrong? <gasps> no! Oh, no! I already solved it, kind of. Oh no. Fran. She's injured. Because Scout said that the the driver of the float probably got injured, you know, probably hit the speedometer and damaged it during the crash. So Oh no, Fran. But it's so obvious. Hmm. There must be more to it then. Oh, nothing. I just slipped in my heels last week. I totally stacked it. Used my arm to break the fall like an idiot. Doctor says it should heal pretty quickly, though. Uh-huh. That's probably the other reason it took you long to get here, is you had to go and change and try to cover up the fact that you did this. Detective Cross, is everything okay? An officer just returned from the victim's address. Apparently, all of his belongings were just outside in black bags. What? Let me scan them. I can see if there's anything important inside. Well, so can our officers, but... Ah, uh, what the hell. This might be quicker. No! Another puzzle! Ah, <laughs> uh, thanks. This is a puzzle game that you expect. Uh, I'm tired, man. I'm tired. <laughs> My brain is like, no. Let's see. Okay, that's pretty set in stone. No, I don't know. Let's leave that for now. Anything else big? Five. 
Something's wrong here. Let me see. And here as well. No, it is two. 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 Three. We got problems already. Okay. Probably with this row. Unless it's this. Could be.
done. Oh, All these ones. Come on. That's a one. That's a one. That's a one. One. Uh, this is tricky. Could be anywhere. No. No. Okay. There. Okay. Okay. Wasn't as bad as I thought it would be. A diary is helpful. Okay, rank E. Woo. This diary could prove useful. Let me read it. Finished. Analyzing text. There are several mentions towards the end of a person he met here. Fran, does the name Roz mean anything to you? What? It, yes, it does. He's referring to one of our queens. Rosmosis. <laughs> Rosmosis like osmosis with water. Uh, they just added the R. That's pretty funny. Oh, who's that? Honor, are you here? Who's this? No, it can't be. Oh, please tell me it's not our mother. That voice. That sounds scarily like. No! <laughs> Dun dun dun! Mom? No! Why is she here? No, I already gave. I already gave Fran my accent. No! <laughs> Why? Oh, that pain in the butt woman. No, she's so annoying. Why is she here? Ugh, she's the worst. Don't move. She can't see you if you don't move. <laughs> yeah, she's a Tyrannosaurus Rex, all right. There you are! I want a word with you. Not this again. Mom, what are you doing here? What a way to talk to your mother! And after I came all the way down here, too. Nobody wants you here. I didn't ask you to. No, but to take the cross, dear, he said you were playing at being detective again, so I brought back up. No, come on, really, Detective Cross, how could you? Top 10 anime betrayal, what the frick, dude? You what? No! No! Seriously, having the mom here is bad enough. You had to bring frickin' a-hole ex-husband Ryan, of all people. Oh my lord, the most toxic, evil people. Oh, they need to get out. I'm sorry, Honor. I know she's your mother, but I think you're better off if you just... Just don't talk to her anymore. Seriously, she's horrible. Ugh. I was just thinking... How could today get any worse? And then, as if my words had been heard by a malevolent god, here you are. Both of you. <laughs> Hello, Honor. How dare you, Mom? Yeah, seriously. How dare you? Great, just what I want. Goodbye, Ryan. Get the F out of here. Goodbye, Ryan. You're the last person I want to see. He's come down here because he's worried about you. Because we're worried about you. When are you going to get it into your head that this isn't any of your business? Uh, uh, I can't talk to you while you're like this. 
I'm going to wait at your apartment. Come see me when you're being a little more reasonable. Well, tough. I changed the lock so you can't get in, mother dear. I wish she would say that. I, oh, the fact she can get into her apartment is horrible, too. Oh. oh, Ryan, babe. That was your cue to leave, too. Don't let the door hit you on your ass on the way out. Uh, but we're already outside. I was talking metaphorically, you asshole. You'd like that, wouldn't you? Harder for you to poison honor against me when I'm right here. Dude, what the frick? That cologne could poison anyone at 50 yards, babe. No assistance needed. Oh! -ho -ho. Will everyone just stop? I don't want to fight, honor. I just want to talk to you. <sighs> and if I talk to you, will you leave? I promise. Fine, Casey. Go back inside. I'm sure Fran could do with your support. Ugh. It's horrible. Gosh, why are you here? I hate I'm so angry. Ugh. This is the worst. Poor Honor. You know, if it wasn't for Casey, I feel like she'd be surrounded by horrible people only. Casey and Scout are the only ones that we can trust. And even Scout right now, it's like, it's hard to trust him, you know, after what uh, Jenna said. But anyway, I think we're going to leave this right here, you guys. Oh, let's just mentally prepare ourselves for the next episode when dealing with this jerk. But until then, thanks for watching and have a nice day. Bye-bye.